Hello everyone, welcome to Talented Developer. In this video, we are going to see how to charge a customer through customer ID. And you can get all the code in GitHub. And the links are already in description. So let's move to the coding section. So what we'll do, first of all, I will come in this function. And I'm going to copy this function. Okay, so I'll just copy. And according to our change, we will change. So first of all, I will keep the name as a charge customer through customer ID okay now what I will do here we are going to pass all the parameters so first parameter we have to focus like we have to add amount okay then I will just go enter the amount like twenty dollar then currency so here it will ask like which format you need currency so I'm going to use as a USD dollar next description so if you add description it's like you can easily get like identification so like we can give here first payment and here we need customer and which customer we are going to do so we'll just go and if you remember in earlier video we have created this customer so I will just go copy paste and I'll put the customer ID next here we have to use charge then create okay so what will happen through the through this uh, function we are going to pass our parameter and once it will successful it will return some charge response okay if it's fail we will see the error here and okay so before going uh, payment with any customer ID please make sure like that customer will have any card if it will not contain any card then definitely your payment will be unsuccessful so let's go and try so what we have done till now we have added all the parameter then we are calling a stripe function and here I'm passing our parameter next I just need to call this function so if everything will be fine we will see the response to the console so let's run this one so once you will run here you can see we got response right all the response like payment meta details we, so we use card so what I will do I will just come refresh this one so once you will refresh here you will see all things so you can see here payment $20 and description first payment this customer and if you scroll more down you can see here this response request we have done so this is charge and here you can also see like what are the fields we passed so these are the our request and these are the response right so here every charge will contain some unique ID this is the charge ID if you want to store you can store your in, in your database else you can re request this customer details so same thing if you go here you can see the charge ID so this is the unique things so this charge is basis on the basis of like customer ID so what will happen when we are going for charge on that time we just enter his customer ID and through this customer ID it just went and it check like okay that customer will contain any card or not so like you can see it's card and you can also see this is the card and this is the default payment so whenever we will charge definitely it will take the default card and it will deduct money from that card so in next video I'm going to show you how to charge on the basis of token we are not going to use that card ID or card anything we're just going to use the token so please subscribe my channel thank you guys